Oak Hill residents say they are blowing the doors off a secret plan to quietly rezone land for a new commercial development. And at a meeting tonight, angry property owners got the city to quickly reverse court. Fox 17's Erica Lathan joins us live from Oak Hill with the latest. Erica. Well, that's right, uh, Stacy. Last month, basically, the city passed a rezoning measure to rezone about 100 acres of property near Franklin Road and Old Hickory Boulevard to commercial. Well, a lot of residents didn't know about it when they found out. They basically turned to signs like this, launching their own advertising campaign. They came equipped with these signs tonight, and they were ready for action. A plan that would have cleared the way for new commercial development in Oak Hill only needed one more vote. They wanted to have a second reading tonight, scheduled the first one right before Thanksgiving and the second one right before Christmas so they could kind of sneak it through. It didn't work because the whole neighborhood found out about it. But on Thursday night, commissioners had a change of heart. After hearing from angry residents, they voted to kill the entire proposal. All those opposed to the motion say no, no. I think that the, the battle's not over. I think we have to keep a close eye on this administration uh, because uh, as we've been gathering information, this is the tip of the iceberg. I'm not going to just forget about it and say that it's done because if we, if we do that another year or two, this will be back on the agenda, I'm sure. Mayor Austin McMullen is afraid the state legislature will end the hall tax, taking away yet another revenue stream for the city. We're trying to analyze what do you do when you lose 65 percent of your revenue. That's obviously a challenge that any city would have to face. Some residents say the estimated $1 million budget shortfall could be made up with a tax increase. If everybody, you know, just as in Bell Mead in Oak Hill paid an extra $500 or so per uh, house, it would completely uh, take up the slack in terms of the uh, lost revenue and everybody that I've spoken to is very willing to do that. Commissioners say they plan to explore all options to make up the revenue shortfall and this time they'll keep residents better informed. Now with tonight's vote, this basically takes that particular commercial rezoning proposal completely off the table. Uh, the commission would have to basically start from scratch if they want to reintroduce that proposal. Live in Oak Hill, Erica Lathan, Fox 17 News.